think throughout all of our vignettes, all the characters we sort of have are based off of, like, real people in our lives that we experience. I know for sure that in my vignette Margot, I'm depicting one of my closest friends. Um, in my vignette Margot, I sort of share the experience of um, a girl that I know closely who's very happy and very um, bubbly, and she sort of interacts with my band teacher who's not so um, pleasant, you can say, and it sort of describes the tension and friction going on in the relationship and what entails and what goes on within it. Within writing my vignettes, I sort of learned a lot about my experiences and what I've learned from them. Um, one of my vignettes describes how I personally feel within, you know, math class because I'm not mathematically gifted whatsoever. And um, I think what I want people to sort of learn from that is that we're not, like, people aren't good in specific things, but as long as you try your best, um, I think you can... Um, they're, yeah, they are based on real characters. Um, they are real people. Uh, one was a crazy Spanish teacher, and the other one was an emotionally disturbed neighbor. My favorite vignette has to be the one about the crazy neighbor, because that was a crazy experience. Uh, my first vignette is about um, a neighbor who his girlfriend leaves him, and he goes around robbing him. Well, in one of the vignettes um, called Do I Know You, it was about my brother, um, he came to visit us finally once in three years, and I was like really angry at him because he never calls, um, and he just he's not like connected with us. So in that vignette, I was expressing how I was angry at him, and how I didn't really like him at the moment, and how I was trying to ignore him, but you can't really ignore your family, so it didn't work. The characters in my vignettes are based on real people. Um, most of the people that I used are my friends, but some of the characters that I used are teachers that I had that I really didn't like that much, like the band director, the, um, the computer teacher. She yelled at us for no reason, so I portrayed her as evil, I guess you could say. So my favorite vignette would probably have to be the blue hoodie. Because in the beginning, I made it seem like it was an actual experience, but in reality, it was a dream that I had. I was a bit shaken after that. But in the beginning, I made it, I tried to make it as real as possible. And in the end, I stated that I was back in my room where I knew I should be, which made it, hopefully, I, I hope it made it seem that it was a dream. My feelings are from life experiences, so writing them were quite easy because I felt the emotions before. I was just go write down on paper. So. The characters were based on real people from real life, and they meant. Basically, they created who I was today by their actions towards me. So. I want to tell them that life is more than what they seem. So. They need to know that life can seem what it is on the surface. The vignette that I like the most, I think, is the one about the 4th of July because it describes a moment in my life where I was happy. I don't know. Okay, so like the first vignette that I wrote is uh, about neighborhood sounds, like describing sounds in prison and prison stuff. And it's really just that. Just, um, my neighborhood and like stuff. So my favorite vignette is the one that I wrote about Hurricane Irene because because it was kind of a traumatic moment in my life so when I was writing it um, I thought back to the moment and it kind of felt like I was experiencing it. In one of my vignettes I write about how I don't want to be typecast into the stereotype that is my surroundings. My favorite vignette is the one that I call The Sky. It uh, describes how I feel about my town and how I just really want to escape this place. I want to be something bigger than I already am. One of the messages that I'm trying to convey in my two vignettes is that 
You can be your own person and where you come from doesn't determine who you are. No, the maid is fine. <laughs> comedy relief. Oh my god, Just comedy. Sit there. Shh, shh. Okay, fine. We'll have comedy. Okay. Woo! Very good. Oh, <laughs> yeah. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. <laughs> oh my gosh. Please don't put that up here. I'm in the video. <laughs> What's your inspiration for writing your bananas? I have no idea. Hitting <laughs> 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 for them. I hate this place. You outline and be quiet. No, I'm I don't know what's a writer. Alright, go. Okay, I hate go. the fanboys. I feel that our vignettes are here to describe more or less our experience throughout our life. Okay, can you? Especially. Cook time!